Oh, we did it! We did it! Woo! Junkrat with the MVP! Oh man, the Junkrat changes are in my corner! Yeah, baby! Gotcha! Here again today with some more super cool, fun stuff in the game, Heroes of the Storm! Thanks for coming to hang out. We have Alex Straza on the live server. Yeah, it's amazing! The life binder, the Dragon Queen, Alex Straza is in the Nexus and ready to be played on live servers. I'm really excited about that, however, one problem. I am short. On the coins, it's sad. It's a super sad day. So we got lots of quests to do. Haven't been playing a lot of heroes in the recent past, but we have lots of stuff to do. We have uh, some quests we can get done. We got this new Dragons of the Nexus quest here, a special event quest. You pl simply play five games and you get a Dragon Queen Alex draws a portrait. When I logged in today, I had a little uh, gift here. This is called a stained, yeah, stained glass Alex draws and Hanzo portrait. That's pretty cool. Here's Hanzo. Here's Alex Straza. Sweet. We'll do that. Absolutely. Absolutely. Let's go ahead and go into uh, what we're going to do today. We're going to be looking at Junkrat. He actually got buffed, man. I was actually super digging Junkrat. He was. He came in the Nexus, and like I was immediately like, this is my guy. I'm really enjoying playing Junkrat. He does a lot of damage. He messes up the battlefield, makes everybody all nervous and excited and not sure what to do because he's blowing them up, he's trapping them, he's doing insane damage, has high sustain because he doesn't have mana to worry about. However, his maximum health was pretty low. So, uh, again, if you like Heroes of the Storm, thanks for hanging out. Go ahead and hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel for all the super cool fun stuff. See you on the other side for the junk rap buffs. We are back, and we're headed to the Dragon Shire. Again, we're going to be playing some junk right here. It's going to look at um, the buffs overall and the changes that came down just the other day in the balance patch on November the 1st. We have on the ally team, Zuljin, Karazim, Nazibo, and Alex Straza, the newest hero to enter the Nexus. This is going to be an amazing battle! We're going to fight for the Dragon Knight in the middle of the map by securing the point at the top and the point at the bottom simultaneously while channeling the dragon shrine dragon shrine there and uh, being able to take that for our uh, ability to push the lane so Junkrat buffs his base health was really low like really super low this is actually one of the things that I figured and hoped would be changed because it was just too low I mean if you look at Tracer and you look at other low, bill low health characters in the Nexus you're going to see that they don't have the, the type of gameplay as Junkrat, in my opinion. Uh, can he get away from stuff? Yes, he can get away from stuff. I mean, there, that is a thing. But it's not like it's super easy, like Tracer, you know what I mean? Uh, we're going to get that. Oh, yeah, you're dead. Oh, this is the amazing part of freaking Junkrat. I don't know why people don't play him all the time. I just love him. <laughs> He's so fun, man. Nice heal. So again, we have an increase in our base health. That's really nice. It's going from 2173 to 1350. So it's a noticeable change. It's a noticeable change. I'm gonna get KT out of place here, and we're gonna secure the kill. Fantastic. Fantastic. Actually, Alex tries to secure the kill, but you get the idea. We can lane. We're gonna head up top. Hit that top lane. Now his health region also went up slightly, 2.7 to 2.8. Now the Frag Launcher, which is his primary damaging ability, you get four charges of this by default. That's gonna hurt. And I'm gonna knock him back when he runs out, and he's gonna be dead, team. Oh, I missed him, but that's okay, he still died. Alex Straza is doing work, man. Your Frag Launcher damage was increased, so it's 117 up to 128, man. That's amazing. I had no, I, I would have never guessed that there was gonna be an increase to the damage of the Q ability. It was just good. It was just already good. I mean, I dig it. Now we're gonna go right here. We're gonna drop the trap just in case anybody comes up. We're gonna shoot our, our uh, frags. So you get, again, you get four of them works on a reload timer. So you're gonna have to reload those every so often. 12 seconds it is. And then you get all four of them back. So it's really nice, really nice. Uh, maybe we can do that. Maybe we can do, oh yeah. Oh yeah, oh yeah, you dead, zombie. You dead, right wing. Oh, they did secure the top, though. That's okay. So the damage is increased, your health's increased, your reach is increased. It's all fantastic. Now, here's the really super amazingly cool fun part. He actually, they actually buffed the talent build that I was really enjoying, which had to do with his W ability, which is Concussive Mine. 
Oh, I need that. There we go. All right, we're going to kill this Kerrigan. Oh, man, he almost got the trap. Can I get this? No. Okay, I cannot. So we're going to take Bonzer Hits. This is going to be an increase of damage to our W ability. Again, the um, Concussive Mind build, which I thoroughly enjoyed as I was playtesting him and playing him quite a bit on the live servers after he came out. We're going to throw that in there. We're going to do that. And then we're going to do that. Oh, I got her locked in the trap, too. That was amazing. I wish I did that on purpose. <laughs> oh, man. No. Oh, dang. Oh, no. This is terrible. How did we spread that mess? So, bonds are hit. Damage is increased by 30 to 40%. Okay, I dig that for sure. Let's go ahead. Oh, that's a problem, team. Oh, we're going to dodge. Oh, I missed. That's okay. Oh, don't blow me up, Alex Straza. The Bonzer hits that we just took, after completion of the quest, it goes up to 40% damage increase. Somebody tell me that's not amazing. If you think that's amazing, comment in the section below and say, Bonzer hits is amazing, because I will agree with you. <laughs> so the Gotta Trap Em All ability E, which was the talent I believe we skipped, yes, it also uh, it had the requirements reduced from 8 to 7, which was kind of nice, uh, because it was pretty difficult to hit all eight of those because people just don't run into the trap you know they're very easily avoided I was actually super interested in making the trap build oh crap the trap build be a thing at first I played it uh, in in the play testing learning the talents learning the abilities learning the hero and then I was like okay this isn't gonna work after I actually used it in gameplay it was quite unfortunate actually because it seemed like a lot of fun to have oh oh that's Alex Traza I thought that was freaking uh oh there he is <laughs> Oh boy, oh boy. Oh no, Karzine, what are you doing, buddy? What are you doing, man? Oh, get in there, get in that thing. Oh dang, you did not get in that thing. And you're dead. Oh my gosh, you have to be kidding me. KT does so much damage, man, so much damage. He is my absolute ban every single time without hesitation. Ch oh boy. Oh yeah, oh yeah, boom! <laughs> Dude, that's the power of the junk rap, man. That's amazing. All right, so again, got to trap them all. Did get a buff. If you want to try the traps again, I haven't done so since the buffs, but it is a thing. It is a thing. So that is nice to consider. Oh, yeah. Traps are down. We're going down to try and get the... We're going to take big as here. It's going to make our steel trap larger, allow it to a better chance to uh, actually land the ability that's extremely difficult to land <laughs> in my opinion all right we're gonna go ahead and make sure we're we utilize all of our uh charges or rounds of our frag grenade launcher now the other change was level seven the sticky wicket the slow duration went up a half a second not a big deal wasn't a talent that i really was taking after my first impression anyway um sticking towards the concussive mine and then also because the the um the trap doesn't get hit very often it didn't make sense to make it slow more or longer because... Oh, wait. Okay. Oh, yeah. We're going to do a little bit of this. We're going to do a little bit of that. We're going to shoot her in the face with all of our frag stuffs. Oh, yeah. Okay, we got to take this point. <laughs> hey, they changed some of the UI stuff. Check that out. That's different. It's pretty cool. Pretty cool. Let's see if we can't push them off here. And that actually is the only change. The one that was, you know, clearly the most excited about was the buff to his health and region health. And then also his frag grenade just being buffed by default, which is super sweet because I was not expecting that one for sure. And then the Bonzer hits, which was my favorite talent of choice after uh, learning to play him a little bit. So, yeah. And it's working out pretty good so far, I think. We haven't died, so that's good. Get, get some stacks there. Well, unfortunately, I only have eight, which I guess isn't terrible. Okay, you don't want to get hit twice by Alex Straza's E ability, which is her fire deal, because you will unfortunately be significantly slowed, which you want to try to avoid. The ally team ha or the enemy team rather has unfortunately reached level ten. Oh, we gotta have to poke on this for sure, boys. Come on. Nobody there? Nobody there? Okay, good. Oh yeah! Oh yeah! You did. Oh, this is going to be a problem. Thank you. Oh, yeah. Come on. I need a talent. What do I need? Rip tire? Rip tire. Let's do rip tire, man. 
I actually thought that they were going to buff his ultimate abilities. I thought they were kind of weak overall. I mean, it's it's really cool. Both of them are really cool, but I think they're kind of weak overall. Oh, that's interesting choice there, KT. He just like yellowed it, boy. <laughs> oh man, that's amazing for us. All right, we're gonna kill this guy. Come on, where you at, Brightwing? Come on, Brightwing. Come on, Brightwing. Can I jump over here? Come on, Brightwing. You gonna die, Brightwing? Bye, Brightwing. <laughs> Oh man, I love that. It's I don't know if it's better or worse, man, but it's it's freaking fun. It is freaking fun. Oh yeah, you want to try and do that, Abathur? I don't think so, homie. All right. Oh yeah, we got this. Nobody at the bottom though. Dang, it's okay. We're gonna keep a push going here. KT is alive. Hopefully, he, or well, maybe not hopefully, but maybe he's paying more attention now, so it just won't be a walkover match. I don't know what that was all about, but. Oh yeah, two more stacks, baby, and a wall to block him. Can we kill him? No. No, too much healing with the double support, which is okay. It's okay. No tanks here to, to speak of. Uh-oh. All right, we do have a problem in the bottom lane. We're not able to secure that, which is not good. Oh, I knocked him out of the freaking wall. No. Oh, we're burning. Everybody's burning. It's so bad. I would say that our duo of healers is probably better than theirs. I like Karazim as a second healer more than I like Brightwing. Oh, yeah, we're stacked now, boys. We are stacked now, homies. We're going in. We're going in. Wait, wait, wait. Hey, wait, wait, wait. Whoa, 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 whoa. Knock her back. Oh, kill her. There you go. That's what's up. That is what's up right there. We're going to go with the slowing, I believe. Yeah, we're going to do the slowing. The Chattering Teeth is nice. Actually, the Chattering Teeth might, have, the teeth might have been really good on this one because you can get those uh, pincer points there or whatever. Pincer points? I don't even know if that makes any sense. <laughs> oh, man, I was going to try to knock him over. Aw, oh, dang. That's okay. Can we get down here to secure the dragon? That's the question. Come on, man. Hurry, hurry, hurry. We can do it. Three, two, one. We got it. Come on. Yeah, we got a baby. Oh yeah, very good, very well played by the allied team. Let's get up here and get some damage. Oh yeah, here we go. The dragon knight. Oh yeah, he's tough. Look at that. They actually buffed the dragon knight not too long ago. If you were not familiar, kick her. Get out of here, man. I'm trying to I'm trying to take down forts. Oh, I thought that was us that killed her. I was like, no way, we killed her. We have a mirror match with our Alex Raza, which is okay. It's not bad. It's not horrible. Oh, man. He, he juked me. Good job. Good job on your part, buddy. I'm just going to go ahead and take down these front walls here. Hopefully, the allied team is messing with the top guys, which is totally fine. That means we are getting more value out of our dragon, which is amazing. But I don't have to tell you that, of course. Oh, there's the Avatar hat. I was wondering where that guy was. Oh, he's on the wall. Okay, whatever. That's cool. I don't know if that was incidental or not, but you are dead now, Abby. You are dead now. Oh, come on, guys. Oh, good. Good kill on the uh, on the KT. Well done. Let's see if we can't take out their sustain here with their their fountain. Kick her. See ya. All right. We are going to be done here, I believe. We are going to be done. All right. Our team is not with us, so we are out of here, man. Let's see if we can't. See if we can't move around. Yeah. Without dying. That'd be amazing. Now, our bottom lane is a little bit pushed in. We did lose the fort in the top, so it was kind of a net zero. That's okay. That's kind of the nature of playing against Abathur, I guess. We do we do have the ability to clear lanes pretty efficiently with Junkrat. He does do 100% splash damage on his basic attack as well as his Q talent, our Q ability, uh, the frag grenade. So that's really nice because you think about... Oh, this is actually an option here. I wasn't sure what I wanted to do. Um, there... Okay, so generally speaking, I am opposed to taking a talent that gives you a negative of any sort. For example, Burst Fire. However, Burst Fire does make you lose one charge of your grenade, which is not good, right? You don't want to lose stuff. However, what it does for you is make some fire off really quickly. Does that count as a... Oh, yeah, it does. Oh, oh no, that's freaking... Oh, no, I didn't think that was Kerrigan. Oh, no. Oh no. That was so bad on my part. That was so bad. Look at how Hammy's going, man. That's crazy. 
Oh, there you go. Yeah. Kill. Well done. Way to go. Yeah. Don't go in there and die now. Good job. Oh, man. So, yeah. What I was saying. Burst fire. It gives you only... It takes your charges of fa frag grenade. Frag launcher, rather. Down to three. Right? However, it reduces the cooldown and it makes them launch in a burst. So that's really nice. However, spread volley makes all of your charges, when, when activated, burst into three different grenades. So you get three, six, nine, twelve shots. That's really cool. I, I don't know. I don't know what to do, team. I like them both. I've never tried this one. Hitting the enemy hero reduces its cooldown. That sounds good, too. We're going to go with burst fire, man. We're just going all in. I don't know. We're just going to try it. It seems to be burst fire is a um, common take on the uh, on the talent builds. Let's see if we can't get somebody coming out. Oh, jeez, lost track of my my mouse for a second. My camera. No, 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 no. We gotta get it. Oh, this is not good. Uh oh, did they break it? They totally broke it. You gotta be kidding me right now. Oh yeah, we're in. We're in. We're taking it. Everything's fine. Nothing to worry about. Everything's all good. We're shooting grenades. So that cooldown reduction is really nice. And actually you can more effectively hit heroes with it as a result of it uh, being a burst shot. Uh oh, dragon's coming. Oh yeah! I love it, people with freaking concussive shot, man. Or a concussive... What's it called? Mine. Mine. Oh, Kerrigan's here. Get out of there. Get out of there. Oh, yeah. Yes. Nope. Sorry. Uh oh, that's a problem. Oh, ow. Ow, ow. I did it right, but I. Oh, stupid KT. I hate KT so freaking much. Ugh. Can we kill this person now? That'd be amazing. Oh, jeez. Can't kill anybody, man. Oh, that was not a good ultimate, I'd say. And cost you your life. Dang it! We're losing it, boys! We are losing it! It's not good. Uh, let's do that. I can't really... I don't think I could do anything here. And Abathur's pushing the heck out of top lane. Oh, no. It's not good. It was going so well! Oh, come on. We can, we can get back here. We can make it back. All right, we're going to do like this, and then we're going to do like this, and she's going to be over here, and we're going to do like that, and we're going to do like that. Kill him. Can we kill him, please? That'd be amazing. Thank you. Jeez. Is Kerrigan all of a sudden, like, invincible, like Varian and Sonya, and I just didn't get the memo? Holy crap. All right, we were able to kill her, thankfully. But man, she's tough, man. All right, we're going to go ahead and try to clear this bottom lane here. Um, they were not able to take the top here and get the objective. However, I don't think that's their game plan. It seems like their game plan is pretty clearly to let Abathur push as much as possible and just prevent us from getting it. You know what I mean? Okay, let's get this thing. Oh, yeah, we're in. Oh, where's my mouse, man? All right, raise your hand and comment below if you lose your mouse at least twice a game. <laughs> Jeez. I don't know what my problem is, but I'll hit him. Yes! Good job, good job, good job, good job. Ah, uh, boom, boom, boom! Get blown up, son! Get freaking blown up! <laughs> oh, man, that was awesome! <laughs> Alright, we're going for boom, pow, man. We're going to reduce the cooldown on our, on our concussive mine when we hit heroes. Of course, we built into the damage and the slowing of our, our concussive mine, which is going to make it do just so much more. Because we're hitting heroes left and right. Now, the unfortunate part of, uh, oh no, going concussive mind build is that it does have a counterplay to your own team. And so that potentially, you know, makes uh, people get out of stuff or, oh, come on, come on, can we get there? Can we get there? Come on, come on. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh yeah, we're in, baby. Should we go to the fort or to the top? I don't know. Let's go, dude, let's go to the freaking keep, man. That's what I meant. Oh, she's going in. She's going in hardcore. Let's do this. Let's get this freaking keep down. That's what's up. Bye-bye, keep. Oh, yeah, you're out of here. See ya. Oh, nice. Nice. Good heal. Good heal. Come on, keep it. Kill it. Keep. 
Everybody's blowed up. Freaking KT, man. Let's get rid of the sustain right here. Oh my soul. Look at that. KT's ridiculous. It's freaking absolutely ridiculous. Get out of here, stupid. Dummy. Burn. Burn. Alright, just chase me. Come on. That's okay. Let's just chase me. Man, I wish there was like a speed him up button, like there is on the terror, garden terror, but there's not, for what that's worth. Abathur has made his way to our keep, unfortunately. We do have a keep advantage currently, for the moment. We're going to take down this little tower here. Maybe we can take this down. I don't doubt it. Let's see if we can't do some damage to her, because she's going to hit me. Oh yeah, kick him. Yeah, get out of here, man. Oh shoot, what the, what the, what? Oh, I'm toast. I think I'm toast, boys! Oh, jeez. <laughs> no! <laughs> Stupid. <laughs> it's a good trap by the Zebo. So, I kicked the Kerrigan. I think the Kerrigan has hacks going on, man. I'm just gonna say it. Look at this. Oh, he's dead. He's totally dead. Oh, the save! The last second save! I dig it. Well done. Ah, oh, 40 second freaking cooldown timer. Ah. Uh. What do you mean, two pro? You didn't kill anybody? What'd you do? You didn't save me? Hey. Oh, now you're all just gonna walk in there and die. Oh, no. Oh, no. Can you do something? Oh, no. Dang it. We did get a kill on their enemy team, right wing. Oh, he didn't take palm. Oh. Oh. Well, I guarantee that. Yeah, see, Kelthos. 88,000 freaking damage! Kelthos is the worst broken hero of the game! KT, most broken hero ever. <laughs> you heard it here. <laughs> Nobody seems to agree with me, though. It's like, oh no, KT's just fine. We can deal with KT, you know, it's fine. Stupid. Get out of here with that mess. Saved your life. You should thank me. Die! Die! Yes! Get the freaking KT! Please! Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, I missed! Oh no! Sorry! The worst junk rat ever! <laughs> Stupid. Uh, oh, they killed the Abathur. That's interesting. <laughs> Uh, 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 I don't even know what to say, man. All right, we got three three enemies dead. This is good. This is really good. We got a chance here. We're going to get this. We're going to get that. We're going to get that. We're going to get this. We're going to get that. We're going to get that. I'm going right there. We got to get the freaking... Got to get the dragon. Zebo can get that by himself, man. All right, we're in it. We're, we're in it to win it. All right, we're going. Get it. Nobody went to get it. Are you kidding me? Why, cruel world? Uh, it's not good, team. It's not good at all. It's not good at all, team. Ugh. Ugh. All right, whatever. I mean, I guess we can all go now since you didn't want to go when I called it. All right, we got this. We got this right here. Nope, they took it. Oh, we got a dragon. Fire in the hole! Come on. Where, 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 where did fire in the hole go? Where did fire in the hole go? Come on. Come on, 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 come on. Oh no. Stupid KT. <laughs> they did, they went down there and got the bottom again though, that's good. I guess that's good. Everybody, just calm down a second. We're going in. Oh, he didn't kill him. Yeah, baby! Okay, okay, we should be able to secure it now. Well done, well done, team. Good job, good job, get it. Yes! Good job! Be positive, we're going core, baby. We're going core. We got two, uh, two enemies down. They should be able to secure this. Yes, this core right here, I believe. Well done, well done. Oh, no, 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 okay. 
Yeah, I heard that miss. Oh, I missed it. Dang it. Oh, she went. She went the cleansing flame. That's fine. It's no big deal. We're gonna do that. We're gonna use that. We're gonna do that. Get, oh boy. Come on. Come on. Can I get a heal? Oh, gotta start. I gotta stay out of that. Oh yeah. See, this is the problem. Flame strike just freaking counters that ability. Her main heal, like so bad. Oh no. Oh, we did it. We did it. Woo! Well done, GG, man. Ah, oh, I dig it. I can't actually. Uh, I thought we were gonna lose it, man. I thought we were gonna lose it. Junkrat with the MVP. Oh man, the Junkrat changes that are in my corner. Yeah, baby. Oh, that's a cool banner. Well done, well done. I'm gonna go ahead and give myself the one up because I feel like I played pretty freaking good there. Um, the Ally team did pretty good, kind of overall. A couple of random deaths here and there didn't make any sense, but. You know, what are you going to do? <laughs> so that's the Junk Rat changes for the latest balance patch, which was a nice little buff, if I do say so myself, especially looking at his uh, Bonzer talent as the primary buff for me, because 30 to 40% increase in damage is noticeable, very noticeable. I dig that a lot. Um, I think the Burst Fire worked out well. I went that level 16. Um, the cooldown reduction makes up for the loss of charge. I would say absolutely. So that's cool. Uh, and the slow, I think, is amazing. 60% slow for two seconds, and you're hitting that freaking concussive mine all the time. Let's take a look at the stats, man. We did put up um, 214,000 siege damage. I was in the uh, Dragonite that one time. 67,000 on the hero damage. Nothing can compete with a KT. But we did top our meter. Very cool. We got the most experience as well. Only died two times. Secured five kills. We're in on 17 total. That's amazing. GG from Gotcha Games. <laughs> Thanks for coming to hang out, guys. If you enjoy Heroes of the Storm, make sure you like the video. Go ahead and hit, hit that subscribe button and the bell to fall right beside it so you can get the updates when we're doing some more super cool, fun stuff. See you next time. Peace out.